Dawn Kasner is suing her daughter's ex-boyfriend, Maxime Belly, for an unpaid loan to pay his bills. This used to be your girlfriend? Yes. Is she still your girlfriend? No. This is her mother? Yes. She loaned you some money? Yes. How much money did she loan you? Two thousand. For what? Between bills that me and Christina had together. You mean the girlfriend? Yes. Did the girlfriend live with you? We lived together some, um, to a point. What does that mean? Uh, that means when she was in school, we lived together, and then when she wasn't in school, we had our own places. She was back at her parents, and then... Well, did I you go to school together? No. So what did you do when she was in school? I was working. So you were working, she was in school, but you were in the same town? We lived separately. Uh, when she went to school, she had a campus she... apartment, and when she had the campus apartment, we lived together. When she had a campus apartment, you stayed at her house? When she had the campus apartment, yes, I stayed with her. Campus apartment was paid for by whom? Financial aid. So she had a financial aid package. Mm -hmm. And you were working? Yes. Were you paying rent? I was paying everything else. Were you paying rent? No. Were utilities covered? Everything was covered. In the rent? Yes. And she was on campus, you were working? Yes. Did you have a car? Yeah. Yes. Yes. Just, you got yes. it right the first time. And what kind of car did you have? Chevy Cruze. What year? 2011. When did you buy it? Uh, 2013. How much did you pay for it? 20000 So you had a car loan? Yes. How much was the car loan? I'm still partially paying it off, so it's a two fifty a month. And who were you working for then? Self-employed. As what? Painting and renovating. So you were a handyman? Yeah. When you could get work? I always have work. Who are you living with now? Uh, I have my own apartment right now. With whom? Myself. Just you? Just me. Where? In Waterford. When did you get the apartment? Uh, a couple weeks ago. Where were you living before that? At uh, my mom's. When did you start living at your mom's? Almost a year and a half ago after my parents split up. So until now you've been living with your mother, except when you were living with this young lady. Yeah. And from when to when did you, yes is the answer. From when to when did you live with this young lady? Well, it was on and off while she was in school. That's when we lived together and then... Month and year, year. <clears throat> Give me the year. For the past four years, we've been on and off when she was in school. Okay, now I want you to tell me where you were when you asked Ms. Kasner for a $2,000 loan. Where and when? I believe I was at my mother's at that time. No, where did the oh, conversation take Oh, actually, take no, place? I, oh. At her house? You were asking me? I wasn't there. At her house. <laughs> when? It was February 14th. 2000 and what? 17. I wasn't there. 17. What did you say to her at the house or what did she say to you? May I borrow some money? And she said to you? Yes. Did she say how much? I asked for 2000. And what did she say? Yes. Great. And did she give you a check or cash? Check. How much did you pay back? 1200. What happened to the rest? What happened to the rest is uh, she gave the she forgave the rest of the loan. Uh, because me and Christina were not supposed to be seeing each other anymore. So she gave uh, an ultimatum, and she to said, she, me and Christina were not supposed to be seeing each other. And after she sued me, I gave her three checks for $1,200. After the 13th of September, that she cashed the first check. A couple days later, she found out me and her were still seeing each other. Well, not, we were still friends. And that's when she called me and said, if you stop seeing Christina, uh, I will forgive uh, the rest of the $800. You're a prince. <laughs> oh. Hmm. <clears throat> right? Well, for paying for Christina for four years, I would be. Your choice. I don't see any shackles on you. You're $800. Judgment for the plaintiff. We're done.